First, first day in full pads. It's a little warm out here, but uh, you got through relatively unscathed. Um, had some good high energy early. And, uh, well, just give, give me some of your thoughts about that. Well, we need to do better in team. You know, we didn't finish like I wish we would. Uh, really had a good practice, you know, about halfway through. Really got some individual things done as we went. Need to pick tempo up in team. First day in pads. I think a lot of anxiety. Got <laughs> first half of practice. You know, they spent a lot of energy because the pads were on. And we had great competition in our competition drills. Then we came to the team. We got to execute better when we get 11 on 11. But a lot of people showed some things today. Now we need those people to continue to move forward so the other guys can follow. It's your fifth practice um, here in the fall. And uh, you've seen a good progression yeah. so far. I have seen a good progression. Now, now that we got through the acclimation, now we really got to go to work. Uh, most important day will be the, the next time we get out here. Next week's going to be huge because we'll start a two-a-day, one-a-day ratio, and we really need to improve each practice. Not each day, but now each practice. Has anybody individually really stood out to you? Well, I've been pleased with Lucas Beatty offensively. Uh, he's shown a lot of maturity, you know, picking up the system quickly. Juwan Blount has come back and uh, didn't get to see him in spring. Pleased to see him. And, uh, you know, defensively, you know, our guys up front, Preston and O.J., Preston Palasa, O.J. Mile, uh, Bradley Taylor's had a real good camp, you know. And then, you know, Keon um, and Doom, you know, are doing well in the secondary. Some of those older guys are standing out that really had good work in the summer, and they're carrying it over the first week of camp.